Hi, this is Scott DeCamp and this is the Catchmark Sportsnet Profile of the Week. Today with us we have Montague senior baseball player Colton Blankstrom. Thanks for joining us today, Colton. Thank you for having me. So it's high school baseball season in Michigan, which means cold weather this time of year. How do you get used to that? I mean, you don't really ever get used to it because then you have, because you start football, it's warm and hot. You kind of get colder as it goes and you have basketball, so you're always inside. And then you have baseball, which is just, when it's like 28 degrees out, it's kind of hard to get used to that. So you grew up playing three sports, baseball, basketball, football. Baseball, I think, is pretty well understood. It's your favorite. You know, what is it like going into your last season for that? Freshman year, I remember just thinking about how long away senior year was, um, and then having sophomore year where it's kind of been canceled. Baseball season, which I was kind of mad about. And then junior year, which was last year, and then just this year having football and then going to basketball and then finally the year is almost done and it's kind of hard to believe. So your dad was a very good player in his own right and in fact he still plays competitively. Uh, what do you learn from him and how much credit do you give him for continuing to carry on in the game? I give him a lot of credit. He's he's always been there. He uh, he's known the game since he was younger. He he always did his best when he was in high school just to get to the next level, and then after that to get to the next level after that if he did. And he's just always been there, just always working hard. He's always taught me to work hard, and just so you can get the stuff you want to get. What have you learned from both parents? I know they're both well known in the community, and they're very involved. That you. You always have to be nice to anyone. Just always greet them. Even if you don't know them, just be nice. Then also, life is hard. Um, they, it's gonna knock you down. You always have to get back up and do your best. You've played in a lot of big games. You won a state title in football, but you played a 14 inning game at Marshfield last year against North Muskegon. How crazy was that game? I mean, I don't think a lot of kids are ever gonna have a moment like that where you end up going into the seventh inning thinking you're gonna win it and then end up going seven more innings to 14 innings and then playing another game after that. It was just one night to remember. It's just, I don't think a lot of kids are gonna have that night. So among your passions are hunting and fishing, outdoors, that kind of stuff. How much of an escape is that for you? I mean, it's pretty nice because when you go hunting, you're sitting in a stand, just relaxing, just waiting, you're just looking at nature, breathing in the air. Kind of same thing with fishing, get out there early in the morning, get the fog on the water, just see the beautiful sun sometimes. Sometimes it's rainy, but uh, it's just always nice to see, just breathe in nice air, look at the things and just relax. So you signed to play baseball at Muskegon Community College. You still have the season to go yet at Mongu. What are your goals individually and as a team? As an individual, um, I know last year I had a great year. I just have to capitalize on that and just keep moving forward. Just do the best I can this year, even if it doesn't go the way I want it to. Just got to keep doing the little things. Um, and as a team, I expect to win a conference championship because last year we, we uh, only had two seniors and we uh, tied for con conference championship. And now we have everyone coming back and some of the sophomores that are now juniors. And I think they could really help us to make a, sometimes a, well, I have a good, uh, to have a long uh, uh, thing in the playoffs. That all sounds amazing, Colton. Thanks a lot for joining us today. Thank you. I'm Scott DeCamp with Catchmark Sportsnet, and this was the Profile of the Week. Thanks for watching, everybody.